This is a spotted lanternfly. Spotted lanternflies were introduced into Berks County, Pennsylvania in 2014 from Asia, established a population, and became a big pest. Scientists observe that spotted lanternfly adults emerge in late summer and live through the fall and love to feed on Tree of Heaven, a plant that also originated in Asia. Spotted lanternflies use their piercing, sucking mouth parts to get to the phloem of Tree of Heaven, which contains sugars, ilanthone, and lots of water. Ilanthone is a defensive chemical that helps the lanternflies become bitter and avoid being eaten by predators. They drink the phloem, removing the parts they need, and discarding the rest in the form of honeydew. Honeydew rains down from the trees when lanternflies are feeding, covering the trunk and surrounding vegetation. Honeydew is a sugary, sweet liquid that is attractive to other insects with a sweet tooth, including butterflies, ants, fruit flies, bumblebees, and honeybees. Spotted lanternfly honeydew from Tree of Heaven happens to be available at the exact time of year when honeybees are struggling to put away winter stores of food. So honeydew is a welcome treat. In the fall of 2019, beekeepers in areas with lanternflies began reporting that their honey was darker than usual and had an unusual taste. The beekeepers that heard that pesticides were being used to control lanternflies and Tree of Heaven, they wondered whether their bees were being exposed to these pesticides too. They also wondered what was causing the honey to taste so unusual. So Penn State and the Pennsylvania Department of Agriculture teamed up to help put together the pieces of the honeydew mystery. We collected honey samples from beekeepers within and outside of the spotted lanternfly areas. We are testing it for things that kill lanternflies, kill Tree of Heaven, and the bitter substance that is made by Tree of Heaven. We're working together to make sure the honey is safe for both humans and bees.